What's up guys? Today I'm going to show you how to create a custom action bar with this menu button right here. Now, I've looked at several tutorials and they have helped me, but I've had to use many different tutorials and online uh, documentation from Google to get me here. So this is going to be straightforward and let's get started. So the first thing you want to do, obviously, is create a new project. Um, I'm going to name it my action bar and we're going to do an empty activity and set this up. All right. Now once we have this, we're going to go into our Android manifest and if you run the app right now, what you'll see is this right here. So we have a my action bar uh, title, and that's because our application is called my action bar. Um, now we don't have a settings icon. So what we want to do is we want to create a custom action bar. We don't just want this thing here with a title. So first thing we're going to do is get rid of that action bar and create our own. So in order to do that, what we need to do is in our theme, we're going to uh, change the style to theme dot app compat dot light dot no action bar. Now, as you see, it's going to change the uh, it's going to change the theme, and now we don't have one. So, we're going to go ahead and create a new layout. And we're going to change this uh, root element to a toolbar. And you're going to want the widget. So our toolbar is going to act as our app bar or our action bar, or whatever you want to call it. All right, so go ahead and create that. And as you see, we have one right here. Now, if we go to design, we can see we have our toolbar. Um, and we can mess with stuff here. I'm just going to go to the text, though. And we are going to uh, hit Command Option L or Command Alt L, and uh, it'll reformat. And we want our height to be a. Uh, we want it to wrap the content. We don't want it to fill the whole screen. So now, as you see, it it came right down. Let me zoom out of here. As you can see, this is our toolbar now just this section. So now it is the size of the uh, of an action bar. Now what we have is a uh, is an action bar but you will not see it just because we need to include it in our main uh, activity. So as you see all we have is hello world. What we need to do is we need to go into our XML. So we are going to have to include our app bar. So layout equals um, at layout app bar. Oops, should probably do this. So do quotes at layout app bar. And then we're also going to give this an ID. So we're going to say uh, Android ID. Uh, we're going to give it the ID of app bar. All right. Now that we have that, we can uh, go into our design and see that it actually did add an app bar right here. And this is the section. So it appears to. Um, be there. So now if we run it on our emulator, we have hello world and we still do not see it just quite yet. So what we got to do is um, our main activity and we're going to create a toolbar um, 
So we're going to create a toolbar and we're going to name it or we're going to find it in our ID, find it in our view using the ID that we gave it. And then we also have to cast it as a toolbar. So now we have a toolbar there and we're going to say uh, set support action bar as our toolbar. So now our action bar is going to be that toolbar that we created right here um, using the app bar layout. So let's go ahead and run it. There we go. We have an action bar. Um, now we're going to, as our next step, we're going to change it up just so it stands out as an action bar and not just some text.